Hello, I'm Roy Disney. I'm here at the Disney Archives, where wonderful and historical memorabilia is lovingly housed. It's a very special place for me and for the legacy of the Walt Disney Company. Walt Disney brought magic into our lives through innovation, creativity, and technology. And so I'm proud to announce for the first time ever the release of the Walt Disney Legacy Collection. Beautifully presented timeless discoveries from our rich Disney archives now available for the very first time on DVD. We know, of course, that it all started with a mouse. But did you know that even before Mickey, there was a rabbit in the Disney family tree? Now, after almost 80 years, Oswald the Lucky Rabbit has returned home to the Disney Studios in his debut on DVD. Creative collaboration has always been a hallmark of the Disney Studios, and in the 1940s, a unique partnership was formed on the studio lot. Destino was an unfinished collaboration between the unusual yet highly respected pairing of Salvador Dali and Walt Disney. In 2003, we unearthed all the existing materials and completed their original vision for this legendary short film. Nominated for an Academy Award, Destino is now presented for the first time on DVD. Walt Disney's love of nature inspired him to pioneer a new form of filmmaking which he called True Life Adventures. The True Lifes were highly cinematic, award-winning animal adventures set in some of nature's most spectacular and remote locations. And since some of my first production experiences were on these wonderful films, True Life Adventures are very close to my heart. The Walt Disney Legacy Collection offers a unique look into our archives and celebrates the pioneering spirit that started it all. It pays homage to what Walt Disney knew best, the power of imagination. It may seem odd to be standing at the foot of a snow-capped mountain in a short-sleeved shirt, but I can do that because I'm near Expedition Everest in Disney's Animal Kingdom at the Walt Disney World Resort in Florida. And it's a pretty cool attraction. Hi, I'm Roy Disney. Like Adventureland at Disneyland Park in California, Disney's Animal Kingdom was inspired by the True Life Adventure series of nature films created by the Disney Studio more than 50 years ago. To film these stories, we sent naturalist photographers to every corner of the world. My uncle Walt Disney set the tone, and my dad, Roy, helped get them made and into theaters. On this volume are several firsts. Walt himself came up with the idea for the very first true life adventure, Seal Island, which debuted in 1948. That was a half hour short subject and won the first of eight Oscars awarded to the series. Four years later, an enterprising young college student, Paul Kenworthy, helped launch the feature-length series with a doctoral thesis project. He filmed the epic battle between a pepsis wasp and a tarantula. That developed into The Living Desert. It became the first of six feature-length True Life Adventure films. To get close to a herd of buffaloes for The Vanishing Prairie, Tom McHugh used a Native American trick of wearing a buffalo skin. We'll also explore The Land Down Under, Australia, and a short subject called Nature's Strangest Creatures. Not released under the banner of a true life adventure, it was basically the same approach. We've included those kinds of nature films in these special volumes, and we've done digital restoration to remove dirt and scratches inherent in the original films. They look better than they ever did before. You'll also find new featurettes in which you'll meet wildlife specialists from Disney's Animal Kingdom as you explore the bonus materials on this set. So now let's start our next exciting exploration of Walt Disney's True Life Adventures. <laughs> 